And now, News Channel 10's 24-7 local weather first alert forecast. Happy Monday to everybody out there. Tanner Brammer here with a midday update with what we can expect for the rest of the day today. Not really much has changed in the forecast for today. Should stay mostly quiet through the early parts of the evening, but we'll see those storms initially develop over toward New Mexico and the western parts of our area by about 5 or 6 o'clock. Should they hit Amarillo, a general time frame is looking from about 6 to 7 o'clock that they move through, but notice how these storms are very much on the scattered side. Not a lot of people are going to see a lot of rain in their hometowns and uh, probably moving out by about 10 or 11 o'clock tonight, taking more of a linear shape, but that won't be until after it moves into Oklahoma and the central parts of Texas. Then we should quiet down for the rest of the night, barring any very spotty showers or very weak thunderstorms overnight into early tomorrow morning. So a look from the Storm Prediction Center does have most of the area under a slight risk for today. A couple of these stronger storms could feature some fairly gusty winds, some maybe moderate to large size sail. And while the tornado threat is pretty low today, you know, we could see the spurting of maybe one or two gust natos here and there so we'll keep a close eye on things through the rest of the day and keep you guys updated as well but after the storms move out like I said we'll quiet down a little bit of a breeze in the air tonight maybe at about 10 to 15 miles per hour lows dipping into the mid 60s as for tomorrow, we'll see a completely different story. Highs approaching 100 degrees in a lot of the area and not really much relief with the winds either. Only at about 5 to 10 miles per hour, mostly sunny skies. So not the best day to maybe make some outdoor plans. But if you do, make sure to stay hydrated and uh, find some areas of shade and don't uh, be working too hard in that brutal sunshine that we'll see not only for tomorrow, but Wednesday and Thursday as well. Approaching 100 degrees Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. South and southwest winds returning back into the area. That'll be thanks to an upper level ridge building back in for the middle part of the week, but maybe an active weather pattern returning to the region going into Friday and the weekend, bringing back the rain chances and temperatures closer to average.